Welcome to Airborne Labs International Mini Bulk Tank Training for ISBT Snow Sampling using Snowmaster 1.3 RFL MBT equipment. Warning! Before sampling, review the MSDS information on liquid CO2. Sampling must be performed in a well-ventilated area by personnel trained in handling pressurized cryogenic gases. Safety glasses, cryogenic safety gloves, and other necessary equipment must be worn. Remove the mini bulk tank's brass plug located on the mini bulk tank's pressure builder assembly and securely store it. Next, connect the supplied PTFE taped female quick connect fitting to this port. Next, unclip or remove the NVR CANS lid assembly and store it in a clean, secure area. Inspect the inner 1 liter NVR stainless steel can area for cleanliness. Ensure this area has a highly shiny mirror finish and is residue or particle free. Weigh the clean empty NVR can using the supplied small DS 2kg top loader balance and record the empty NVR can unit to the nearest 0.1 gram. Ensure this balance is sitting on a level surface and not exposed to wind or drafts. Next, remove and store the male quick connect plastic cap. Check all inlet assembly valves and fittings for tightness, overall hardware cleanliness, and integrity. Securely attach the weighed 1 liter NVR can caddy assembly onto the Snowmaster 1.3 head unit. Then securely insert the Snowmaster Special Quick Connect Inlet Purge Assembly into the female Quick Connect port. Ensure the mini bulk tank's liquid face petcock valve is in the off position. Purge valve is opened and the snow valve is closed. Open the mini bulk tank's liquid source petcock valve. Within a few seconds, snow should begin to be generated and exiting the purge valve. Let the tank purge for about 10 seconds, then close the purge valve and immediately open the snow valve. Start the DT5 timer at this point. Within a few seconds, snow should begin to spurt from the four vent ports. After about a 30 second period of initial snow venting or cool down, the unit quiet downs after it fully chills and begins to fill with snow. Allow the one liter NVR can to fill with 200 plus grams of snow. This typically takes anywhere between 1.5 to 2 minutes max or is signaled by an increase in snow spurting again from either the vent ports or from the slot areas of the head assembly. Close the snow valve, immediately open the purge valve and shut off the petcock in that order to allow the line to depressurize. 
Next, unlock and remove the snow-filled NVR can and immediately reweigh it on a digital scale to the nearest 0.1 gram. Determine the net sample weight. Net sample weight is equal to the snow-filled can weight minus the empty can weight. Record all weight data and other needed ID data on the sample ID tag. Reclip the special loose-fitting lid onto the can and allow the snow sample to totally evaporate or sublime in a secure area. This typically takes about 2 hours and can be accelerated by use of an IR warming lamp. Detach the Snowmaster head assembly, thoroughly dry the head with a lint-free towel, and replace its male quick connect and cap. After snow has evaporated or sublimed, unclip the lid and carefully observe the NVR can's interior for evidence of oil film, grease, particulate matter, or foreign odor. Record all observations on the ID tag and securely reclip the lid. Do not attempt to ship an NVR can until all snow has sublimed. After completion of all liquid port sampling activities, remove the female quick connect fitting from the mini bulk tank and replace the brass plug. Place the NVR can lid assembly and all other kit parts into the appropriate lower tray of the shipping case. Fill in all needed information on the analysis authorization form and store it in the upper tray. Use FedEx Express overnight service to return these non-HAS samples to ALI for testing. Thank you for participating in the mini bulk tank training for ISBT snow sampling using Snowmaster 1.3 RFL MBT equipment. Questions can be directed to your instructor or sent to Airborne Labs.